Hello and welcome back to Teach Me Money Methods. In this video, we're going to be doing some AI content creation. I like to attack it from different angles. And in this case, we're going to start on Amazon, the Amazon platform, because we know that uh, there are almost any niche that you can think of under the sun is on Amazon. And you can be selling digital products, uh, ebooks, or physical products of any sort. So we're on the Amazon pro platform and you can just come over here and actually like start looking through the departments, right? To get ideas. Let's say you have a YouTube channel and you need a video idea or you have a blog um, and you're gonna, you wanna do like a top 10 review of some, some, of some sort or benefits of a product. So we're just gonna kind of look through here and I'm just gonna kind of scroll down and we're gonna pick a category um let's see here let's just kind of go with home and kitchen and then so in the home and kitchen uh, category i'm just going to type in best and we're going to see what comes up so best toaster best toaster oven best air purifiers for home uh, best grandma gifts these are all great keywords right that people are actually searching for because it's right here amazon's telling us that people are searching for this stuff so let's go with the best air fryer. Air fryers seem to be really uh, popular the last couple of years as they've gotten more popular and came out. Uh, it's a healthier way of cooking and getting a similar effect of fried food, only you're not using all the oil and grease. And so let's go ahead and click on best air fryer. And this is just to kind of get ideas, right? So now we just use the keyword suggestion tool. You could, we could stop right here and I have enough information to go ahead and start writing content because now we could do reviews on these specific items, right? If you have a channel like that and you would just have an unlimited amount of products. I mean, you have over 6,000 products right here just for air fryer alone. You would never run out of video ideas or blog topic ideas, right? So we're going to type in best air fryer. So I'm just going to go grab that right um and then we can come back over here and we're going to go into my favorite new favorite content creation tool which is a conversion ai and at any point if you want to try out the the system for free you can click the link in the description and it will take you where you can sign up for free and they'll give you 10,000 credits for free and you can try the try it out for five days um, to see what it can do for your business, right? So um, right here, you can go over to the dashboard and you have all these different um, sections here, modules that you can use in order to create um, this very specific um, content need that you're looking for, right? All kinds of stuff. I mean, it, it, they get so specific. You can have this, this software can write bios for you. Um, it can write testimonies for you. It can do all kinds of stuff for YouTube videos and it can do questions, all kinds of stuff. So there's a lot of new, uh, stuff that I'm going to be going, um, over probably individually because they have come out with a lot of new stuff. I like how they have a new tab here. You can click on the new and it'll actually come up with all this new stuff. Those are all each individually for probably separate, uh, training tutorials. But in this case, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go into blog. Blog is a really good one. When you're trying to uh, create content for either YouTube or if you're trying to uh, create a blog post and rank it on uh, Google. So we're going to come over here to blog type of topic ideas and I'm just going to go right here and I'm just going to kind of remove everything real quick. And right here we can put in best air fryer um, as a topic idea or we can even do uh, something like air fryer, um, you know, something like top air fryer uh, benefits um, or something like that, right? And then, um, you know what? I'm just gonna go over here to Amazon and grab an air fryer and grab a little bit of a description from one of these just because they have a description of stuff. So we'll just grab something here, like some content here, and then we'll come back into conversion AI and throw this in here. Now, since I'm an unlimited prober um, member, I can have up to 600 characters in here, which is really nice. And let's see where we're at. I'm going to go ahead and remove that last little line. And you can put in your um, audience here if you want. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and skip that. And you can also put in a tone of voice, um, like right here. We could put in professional or formal or something like that if we wanted to. But I'm going to go ahead and just leave it um, empty. And then we're going to go ahead and just push uh, three outputs. And we're going to see what happens. It should come up with some uh, po blog post ideas for us. 
And so how to make the Pioneer Women Chicken. I don't really like that one. Um, what to know What to know about air fryers. That one's a good one. So that could be a blog post topic. Um, and then how air fryers are changing the cooking world. So uh, that's pretty cool. So that both of these are pretty, um, you know, engaging. I'm going to go with the copy to clipboard. So we're going to copy that one. We're going to go back over to dashboard now and then go click back on the blog. So then now we want to get a blog post outline. So now we're going to throw in what we think we're going to title this, right? I'm going to get rid of the quotes. Um, and then we want helpful. We're going to do like a helpful type tutorial. I'm going to click that again to generate content for us. So notice we're not doing any writing ourselves. We're just going to let the tool do all of the hard work for us. Uh, I am going to open up a notepad real quick. I like to get a notepad going right here on the side. And then I'll come back over here and kind of minimize that down. So we have our title. So I'm going to throw that up here, right? And then now we want, we have an outline, right? So what is an air fryer and how does it work? The benefits of using an air fryer, recipes for healthy uh, foods to make in your air fryer. You can use that um, to do, do just kind of searching through here. So yeah, this is great. We're just going to grab this one. There's six tips here. So we can grab that. And then I'm going to come down over here and paste those in right here, right? And then I'm going to actually do a double space, actually a triple space right here in between them. And I'm just kind of showing you how I've been using the tool to let it do all the work for me. But right now, I also want an intro paragraph, right? So what we can go back is go into dashboard and we're going to go back into um, blog and then we can go blog post intro paragraph, right? And so now we have our title. I'm going to go ahead and throw the title up here. You just follow the steps, you know, it just tells you exactly what to do. And then you can say people looking for an air fryer and we're just going to go a couple of those <clears throat> and it's going to go out there and actually like write an intro paragraph for us which is just really really cool so we can grant uh, grab any of these i'm going to grab that intro paragraph and throw it up here and so we have the in little intro paragraph um, air fryers are changing the cooking world for the better. They're not as healthy as a stovetop or oven, but they offer convenience that's hard to beat. With an air fryer, you can have fried food without all of the guilt. You'll be able to enjoy your favorite foods like french fries and chicken wings with less oil, right? And you can continue writing that um, if you wanted to to make it bigger. You can go into the long form assistant and um, even extend that paragraph. But so now what we're going to do is go into our final a couple steps here. We're going to go back into blog right here. And or actually, it's not under blog, but I just actually searched for it. Which one is it? It is the sentence expander um, or the content improver. So the content improver, I like to click on that, right? And I'm going to take this first right here. What is an air fryer and how does it work? So we're going to copy that. I'm going to throw this in over here, right? And right here, I'm going to do help. We're going to do helpful tone and we're going to generate a couple different outputs. And the cool part about this is if you have the pro unlimited version of this, then you can, you have an unlimited amount of use or credits with the software. So you don't have to worry about all the credits and all that. So I do recommend that if you're serious about your business, you'll have unli unlimited content to write eBooks to sell this content, to create YouTube videos, to create blog posts, uh, the, the list goes on. So we have um, a couple different options here and it's going to write that. You can read through that, but it's going to be good. Um, I've gotten to where I've kind of trust the content and I'm going to go ahead and just throw this in over okay. here, right? And then that consuming all of these extra calories and cooking oils. So what I'll do is I'll usually read the last part. Um, it means it will be healthier for those wanting to stay on their diet as well as being sustainable for our environment by not consuming all of those um, extra calories and cooking oils. So that one, it, it is good. So you can just put a period there. So then we're going to come back through here. I'm going to grab this one. I'm going to throw this in over here and I'm going to go ahead and speed this process up. Um, and you'll kind of see, um, see it working in action. I'll just go ahead and speed the video up so you can see me just going through the steps real quick.
Okay, so we have our content. You can see how I did that. I didn't like the output of that, so I actually rephrased the question and then it spit out some really good tips right there for me. So then now what I'm gonna do is I'll take this entire thing so we can write a conclusion now. And so what we're gonna do is we're going to take probably the first tip maybe. I'm just gonna grab about that much content. We're gonna come back over here to dashboard. And then we're going to go back over to new and we're going to go back to blog post conclusion. We can put in a conclusion paragraph here. So we're just going to get rid of all that text there. Throw the throw this in here and then we can just say, you know, um, click the link below for more information and push the uh, right AI content. So. Now it's going to go out there and write a conclusion uh, paragraph for us. So it has um, every step of the way, um, it has something for you, right? So I'm going to go ahead and grab that and throw that in at the bottom here. And then we'll see how much content we ended up, ended up with. I'm going to get rid of the part that says conclusion paragraph. We don't need that. Now what we can do is control A, copy this, right? And then we're going to go ahead and open up Microsoft Word. You can use Google Docs to do this check as well. Let's open up a blank sheet here and then I'll just do a paste. And so right here, uh, without doing any writing whatsoever, you can see we had 829 words. We could keep going. We could keep expanding on every one of these topics, but I didn't write any of the content here um, at all, right? I didn't write any of this content and you have um, a nice base starter. And if you're doing long form content, then you can grab this, take it and, and put it into what's called the long form content um, module, right? And that part of the software, you just come over here and you just put it into this long form content. And then you can actually um, have the software extend all of the content for you and end up with a 1500, 2000, 3000 word piece of content really, really quickly in about 15 minutes. Once you get good at using the software and understanding like how you get the best results, you can write this stuff really, really quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and grab this real quick. And, you know, to, to show that, you know, it's completely 100% human readable content, but I'm also going to go and check Copyscape. Now, sometimes it will spit out um, maybe one or two results in Copyscape. But as you can see right here, we just pasted the entire content that we just had. Um, Conversion AI wrote all this for us. It's completely 100% human readable content, which is just amazing. And uh, we have no results. So this is, you can take this, you could publish this on Amazon, you could publish it as an ebook, you could publish this on your own website. And you know, no one's gonna know that a robot wrote all this content for you. It's human readable. What the content, what the algorithm of Conversion AI is actually doing for you is it's going out at the speed of light and um, reading thousands of pieces of content online in a matter of seconds and then kind of um, coming up with some important topics to what you're telling it to do. And then it just kind of rephrases and rewrites it and um, what it just learned. So each time it goes out there and it learns the different things, it has a massive, massive billions of pieces of information, a database. And so it's able to pull from that and rewrite it at the exact same time. And that's why you're getting 100% human readable uh, content that a robot uh, named Jarvis is writing for you. So that's it for this tutorial. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, I'm just always trying to bring different uh, kind of strategies and ways to look at things. You know, when you first log into Conversion AI, you might look at it and be like, oh, you know, I kind of don't really know what I'm doing here and stuff. But um, when you have tutorials like this, it can give you, it can kind of open the door to what's possible, uh, how to use uh, the software. When I very, the, my first couple of days using it too, um, I was using the long form assistant and all that, and um, I'm actually getting better results. Um, you know, you just saw I wrote um, an 830 word piece of content, fully outlined, new title, everything, every single part of the way we got from uh, Conversion AI. And I didn't even use the long form assistant, right? I didn't even use the long form assistant to do that. And I still am getting close to a thousand word article in 10 minutes. So there's uh, multiple ways to use the software, but this is the, uh, the best content creation uh, platform out there. So if you're interested, click the first link below and I'll see you in my next video.